This video is sponsored by BuyCheapMuttCoins.com. For all your Mutt coin purchases, use code Ryan at the checkout, BuyCheapMuttCoins.com, and you will get 5% off all of your purchases. I know a bunch of people are asking me if PS3 coins were going to be in stock soon, and yes, they are right now. Go ahead and go to BuyCheapMuttCoins.com. Link is in the description below. Use promo code Ryan, 5% off. All right, guys. So I was kind of reading some of my comments on the Pack and Play video, and while a couple people were definitely excited to see Pack and Play make its return, there was a couple people that said pack and play should be used and you should do pack and play when everyone has a really good team in the middle or the end of the year and then you're using your bronze, silver, and you know gold team against them. It's a lot more fun, a lot more entertaining to watch because a lot of people right now have teams that are similar to mine and at least the tiers that I'm in where like I have a bunch of silvers, I have a bunch of bronzes, and then my opponent has a bunch of silvers and a bunch of bronzes. So I don't know exactly what you guys would want to see. If you want me to continue to do pack and play right now, um, I definitely enjoy doing it. It's not very hard for me to do it all. Uh, the only issue is my coin amount, and I'm probably going to do something stupid again with my coins here in this video just because I can't stop. Like I, My way of doing Madden Ultimate Team, the, the way I've always been so good at getting a bunch of coins and the way I've always been so good at getting a bunch of good pools is to pull packs and for some reason I can't shake the feeling like no matter if I sit there and tell myself don't pull packs Ryan don't do it you know you're, you're gonna lose coins you're not gonna have enough coins to you know do your videos and stuff I continue to pull packs I just cannot stop myself because I know that my luck is really really good and sometimes you know that one really good pool will happen and I'll have a bunch of coins so um, that ties into pack and play it ties into if am I not gonna have enough coins to do this all the time? What's gonna go on uh, right now as you can see my binders kind of filled with a bunch of cards that I could sell I mean each and every single one of these 85 overall cards is pretty much a pack for pack and play I mean I could sell uh, Wisniewski Julius Thomas Peters, you know this BCA TJ Lang that's like four or five packs right there um, I think it goes for like 21, 24K, maybe even upwards of 30K. So I'm not really hurting too much for coins, but at the same time, like when I look up at my coins and I see 23K, I'm like, what in the world am I doing? Why did I do that? Why do I spend coins so much? And it's just how I have fun in Ultimate Team, I guess. Everyone has their own specific way of having fun playing Ultimate Team. You know, people like to spend money on the game. People like to have a bunch of coins. People like to have a really good team. You know, people don't really care too much about coins. Some people just like to have a really good team, like to play, you know, head-to-head -head seasons and do the best they can, get high on the leaderboards. Well, my way is to, you know, have a bunch of coins and then always be able to entertain you guys with video updates and, you know, things like that. So, um, like I said, I mean, if you guys want to see Pack and Play, Right now, I'll continue to do it, but I'm kind of just trying to pull the audience, I guess, and let you guys, you know, talk a bunch of shelves in the comments. Maybe you guys have some theories, or not not theories, maybe you have some little comments or criticism you want to say about pack and play. Uh, if you want to see me continue to do it, uh, tell me you want to see me continue to do it. If you want me to hold off until later on in the year when I have a shitload of coins, you know, like when, when I usually have like a million or two million coins, and I'm able to just crank out videos non-stop rapid fire and then go up against teams that are much better than mine like you know the super high overpowered teams with a bunch of 99 overall cards and then it's so entertaining to see like a 75 80 overall sammy watkins come in and make that team look like a baby you know i mean i understand where some people are coming from where you know it's not very fun to watch you use a squad that's kind of similar to other people's squads right now because it's really early into the mutt uh mutt 15 um, but at the other hand, you know, I did say I was going to upload pack and play all year long and I don't want to let you guys down. So let me just know in the comments if it's more so towards hold it off, wait until you're fully prepared and fully able to do pack and play every week and then go up against a bunch of good teams. I'll do that. But if people want me to just continue grinding it out and doing it right now and see how good I can make my team. And eventually when I go up against those superpower teams at the end of the year, I'll have a superpower team as well. So let me know in the comments below what you'd want to see because definitely I understand where both sides are coming from. And, you know, in my honest opinion, if I was to make the decision, I kind of like playing pack and play. I mean, I was kind of upset that I wasn't uploading and I was kind of upset that I was sick and I couldn't really get a bunch of videos out. And I'm still, you know, kind of sick. My voice is still kind of messed up. But it's to the point now where I can continue to crank out videos. It's uh, it's getting better. Um, I was kind of worried for a while. I wasn't able to... I wasn't able to uh, 
get my voice back. I'm like, oh my god, is it going to be gone forever? Did I was I sick so bad that uh, it messed up my vocal cords or something like that? That's terrifying to think about for me because of course I do YouTube videos and I want to always be able to provide good content for you guys but not when I sound like Mike Tyson, you know, kicked in the ball. So, uh, like I said, let me know in the comments below. If you want me to continue to do pack and play, then be prepared because pack and play is going to explode your sub boxes. I'm really ready to play. I kind of want to play right now, uh, but if you want me to hold off and you think it would be better for me to just, you know, do a bunch of coin-making tip videos and, you know, a bunch of game plays with a, a decent squad team and, you know, just normal game plays with... I guess cards that I buy off the auction block, then let me know in the comments below. Uh, but anyways, we do have 23k, and like I said, my itch to open up packs is always going to be there. So let's go ahead and see if we can cap off this little, you know, one-on-one -on -one -on -one or one-on however many people are going to watch this video talk, one-on 3,000, 4,000, however many people watch the video. I just like to talk to you guys. I mean, that's one of the main things I like to do in videos is just sit down, talk to you guys, and just have fun. So let's go ahead and open up some packs. Let's see if we can summon the old X Ryan 915 where I open up one pack or open up two packs and we just get a crazy card. We haven't had a legend pull all year. Let's see if we can get something that's going to make this video awesome. So let's go ahead and see what these packs are looking like and let's go ahead and see if we can get something out of it. So LP Field, Tennessee Titans. Uh, we got Marcus Sheryls. Let me go ahead and clear my voice just a second. <coughs> We get Marcus Sherrills, we get New England coach, uh, Avery Jones, defensive tackle of the Jaguars. It's a really, really low quality image right there they use for that card. Never even heard of that guy. Jack Crawford, Jonathan Stewart, Vikings away uniform, uh, Maurice Hurt, and we get a green card. We get Antoine Smith, football outsiders. Hey, at least it's something other than a gold card. Antoine Smith, 94 speed. Look at that card, 94 speed, 93 agility, 83 awareness, 94 acceleration. 90 carrying, 84 ball carry vision, 93 looseness. That's actually a really good card, guys. And he's actually kind of short, too, which you'll be able to bust through a bunch of holes and, you know, be a little bit shorter than everybody else, kind of running around like Darren Sproles out there. That's a really good card, I'm not going to lie. I would definitely recommend picking that up. I might have to play a game or two with him. That's a really cool card right there. I uh, got enough for about two more packs. Let's see if we can get anything, you know, super, super good out of these packs. I'm really banking on getting something good. I just want to see that I still have the power to just pull something out of nothing when I don't have a lot. So Brian Hoyer, Jeff Fisher, Pat Edwards, Levi Stadium. Come on. I'm, I'm feeling this pack right now. Come on. And we get a Nick Roach. So, um, yeah, we're not going to let that put us down. We're going to go ahead and pull one more pack, and we're going to go ahead and call it a video. Mainly, like I said, the point of this video was to kind of pull the audience and see what you guys want to see, pack and play or not wait off or like hold off until the end of the year or continue to just crank it out because definitely i'll do either or it's all about you guys it's always going to be about you guys whatever you guys want i'll definitely provide it so one last pack come on let's summon like i said let's summon the old x ryan 915 let's turn on that switch let's get a legend pool let's go we'll get ourselves another gold card and it's lorenzo alexander so unfortunately um, my little, you know, trying to pep talk myself. Let's go ahead and pull a pack. Let's get some packs. Let's get a really good card. Kind of didn't work out right there, but, oh, you know, just, you got to take a chance sometimes. You got to try to do what you got to do, and it just isn't working out for me right now. So, unfortunately, um, I may just go ahead and try to get rid of that portion of me that wants to pull packs. Uh, you know, another thing, like I said, I, I wanted to upload this video just sit down and talk you just have a little chill kind of commentary um talking to you guys about pack and play and kind of talking about the way i play ultimate team and then again uh in my head i wanted to go ahead and say okay i'm down to 24k i'm gonna open up a couple packs if i don't get anything while explaining my addiction to packs then that's going to be the first step in curing that addiction so i think for the time being at least i'm going to try not to spend so many coins on packs I think it's just overall a stupid idea for me. I definitely do want to get a bunch of good pulls for you guys and have a bunch of freakouts, but uh, Mutt has kind of changed his ways. I mean, you don't get too many good pulls out of packs anymore. You don't get, uh, all, like, every other pack in, like, Mutt 12 or Mutt 13 kind of seemed like you were getting at least a 95 to 99 out of every single pack. I mean, I know you guys remember opening up those off-season packs when they decreased the price. You could buy bundle after bundle after bundle and make coins over and over and over again. That was so fun. And I'm trying to get away from doing that because it just doesn't work out for me this year. And maybe eventually as time goes on, the switch will return and I'll be able to open up, you know, just a crazy amount of coins. 
in packs and stuff like that from having a lot of good cards. But as of right now, it's just not working out. And it kind of ties into uh, telling you guys that as well. I mean, I know a lot of you guys say the little promotion thing that I do where I say this video is sponsored by BuyCheapMuckCoins.com. Go ahead and use promo code Ryan at checkout to get 5% off. Um, if you guys do do that, you guys need to realize that don't spend those coins right away on packs. Definitely be sure to go to the auction block, look at the cards you want for your team, and buy them there. I think if you use the website, use my promo code Ryan, and you get those coins, don't just spend them on packs right away. Definitely go buy the cards you need off the auction block. And I know a lot of people are going to say that website sells coins for way too expensive. You know, it's not very cheap at all. Um, and, you know, while it may be more expensive than other prices you see on Twitter, uh, you can't really devalue the coins. You want to make sure that you always keep coins at a premium because the coins are actually worth a lot of, of money. I mean, if you want to sit there and open up a bunch of packs, think about how much a BCA bundle is or think about how much a legendary bundle is. You're spending more than you do on the game. And if you actually make that into coins, imagine how much the bundle would be if you bought it with coins. It would be absolutely unbelievable. So you want to actually go ahead and be safe with what you do. I know there's a bunch of people on Twitter that you could trust to get a bunch of good deals but if you don't know those people on twitter if you don't have a twitter buy is a very safe and reliable way to get your coins like i said ps3 stock is up now xbox one xbox 360 ps4 so for all your mutt coin purchases be safe about it go to buy get your coin purchases get your use promo code ryan at the checkout and get what you need done because they're definitely safe and reliable and i definitely recommend using them for sure anyways if you do like the video Go ahead and subscribe in the bottom right corner to subscribe here. And if you like the video, go ahead and give it a like. Definitely does help me out. I will be posting Pack and Play Like Crazy. Just let me know you guys want to see it, and then I'll continue to post it. If not, I'll hold it off, save up my coins until I have an absolutely crazy amount of coins, and then we're going to go ham on all those Super 99 overall teams at the end of the year, just like we did in Madden 25. But we'll do it a little bit earlier. So just let me know in the comments below. I'm out of here, guys. Peace.